Hey guys, how are you doing today? It's been a long time since my last video, about a year and a half and today I want to talk about what's been going on and the future of the channel. And most importantly, I want to apologize to everyone who's been waiting for my new videos because I never intended to go on a hiatus without pretty much saying a word. It's just that my life situation hit me hard, which I will be explaining later on in this video. But first, I will give you a short answer regarding the future plans of this channel and then I will tackle on to the details, so please hear me out. So the future of this channel is mostly going to focus on gaming related top 10 videos. Instead of prioritizing on a single game, I am going to generalize everything and do top 10 videos about any game or topic as long as it's gaming related or something I find worth talking about. Another addition will be the use of animation, which I've been practicing behind the scenes, which works greatly as a supplementary tool to future videos, and I personally think it's a fun extra overall. That being said, if those are the type of videos you're interested in and want to stay subscribed, I humbly welcome your stay and will be really thankful for that decision. If not, I respect your decision making on that end as well, don't worry. I've categorized this video in three different sections which we tackle on one by one as I feel the need to explain to you guys what's been going on, the future plans in greater detail, as well as final words and thoughts on my end. So, let's begin. The main reason I stopped making videos back in early 2019 is because I felt overwhelmed. I just wanted to get off social media for some time because it started to impact my daily life in a negative way. I felt more anxiety than ever and I started to lose myself, my own identity as a person and it just didn't sit right for me. So for the sake of my own mental health and overall well-being, I just had to get a break from YouTube, get some fresh air and think about what I want to do with my life and what are the right decisions for me to make. So what did I do after the hiatus? I went to work on a local company to do some logistics work that lasted about a year or so, and quite frankly it was mostly a positive experience because I got to see different perspective within the working industry, which is just a good thing overall. Learning new skills and experiencing things from different angles gives you inspiration and helps you figure out what you really want to do with your life. Towards the end of that working period, I ultimately felt that while the logistic work seemed nice, it's not the type of work I want to do the rest of my life, so I returned to thinking what is the right choice for me. I ultimately decided to return to YouTube, make a plan on how to execute it all and proceed from there on. So I hope you guys understand why I took a step back from social media for some time and why this working period helped me to develop as a person and how it gave me time to think what to do in the future, which I am glad I did because no one knows how bad things could have turned out if I just did continued normally, aimlessly, without any clear structure or plan. Also, few notes regarding the games I've been covering on this channel prior to this video. League of Legends was obviously the biggest hit, because at the time when I did a lot of League videos several years ago, it wasn't an exciting time to make content from that game, and I had a lot of real life friends to play with, which made the game a whole lot more socially engaging, and in general, more enjoyable. After some time the interest started to fade out, as I had done over 60 top 10 videos from that game alone, as well as most of my friends quit the game, which negatively affected my motivation to play as well, so I decided to move on to other games, namely CSGO and Overwatch. I still had a lot of fun playing those games too, but they never caught as much attention on the channel overall, which saddened me but was to be expected, as I had profiled myself as a league channel, especially at the beginning, but I still tried to carry on because I wanted to get that same hype as I had in the league days. And sure, it was fun, but it never exactly felt like the craze of the best LOL days. After those two games, there was some let's play type of content somewhere along the way, and then I really got interested into this battle royale game called Spellbreak, which was super hyped back in its alpha beta days, but the excitement died shortly after realizing I didn't have again that many friends to play with, so it kind of died out for me. I felt overwhelmed and started the break after that. 
So after analyzing my past, I personally think the generalization and focusing on top 10 videos overall will be the best direction for this channel. I still want to make videos from the games I have covered in the past on this channel, but I am not going to focus on a single game anymore because it just doesn't work for me in the long run, as I've learned the hard way. Now that I know what my plan is for this channel, Hepodix, let me further discuss that to you guys now. Like I mentioned at the beginning of this video, I want to do gaming related top 10 videos, because back in my League of Legends days, those type of videos seemed to interest most of my viewers, so I want to continue on that trend. There could be some other types of videos occasionally, but mainly focusing on one type of videos makes the channel's vision and direction more straightforward. Some of you might ask why don't I just focus on one game instead of generalizing this top 10 ordeal? The reason is that this type of structure gives me more creative freedom to do more interesting and great videos and for the sake of longevity and future. I wanted to free myself from the shackles of focusing on one game only and it gives me more variety to talk about different things in general. I am first going to do few top 10s on my own terms talk about topics I think will make for a great video and which I personally enjoy. But after some time, I want to start asking the audience via either straw poll or reading the comments what types of top 10s you guys want to see me make, which I will take heavily into consideration as well, but obviously ridiculous or straight up stupid ideas will never get into fruition. The pacing of the uploads goes as follows. I want to do one video minimum per week, aiming to publish a new video every Friday, and if I can push the production hard enough, there could be an extra video for Sundays too. Of course I am aiming to release as many videos weekly as possible in the future. You guys need to remember that I am a one-man crew right now, and the production process consists a lot of phases for each and every video to be completed before being seen by you guys on YouTube. I am however getting some help behind the scenes, but the majority of the work is done by me. I don't want to publish some half-baked videos either, because quality control and certain standards needs to be met before I think a video is good enough so I can finalize it and then release that to the public. I have a huge list of top 10 ideas already made, which is a good thing, so I have a lot of work to do, and your suggestions in the comments section and possibly on the future straw polls are more than welcome as well. Before I end this update video, I want to mention couple more things that I think are important. First of all, I am 27 years old at this day and age, which means that I have to supplement myself financially. The dream of mine will be get this channel rolling on such a way that I could do this full time and thereon get more videos and content to you people because this all means a lot to me right now and I want to make things right this time. Outside of ad revenue from YouTube, I'm considering opening up Patreon for those who want to support my channel, but I definitely don't want to do it right away. There could be also some sponsored content here and there, but I don't want to over push it either because you're here to watch top 10 gaming related content, not some full on sellout advertisement videos, but like I mentioned above, this might be necessary at times to give me the stability I need to accomplish my dream to produce these videos full time without too much stress. Hope you guys understand. Alongside this video I will be publishing my first top 10 video with the same style I've done this one and it's called top 10 underrated games. Let me know what you guys think about all of this in the comment section below. Constructive feedback helps me a lot to develop as a better content creator. Lastly, if you want to support me right now, let your friends also know about this channel so that they could stop by and say hi. For direct inquiries, please refer to my Discord page information at the video description below or just comment on this video and tell me what you think about the changes. And as for Twitch.tv, I don't currently have any plans to stream because the YouTube side of things will consume such a large amount of my time right now, so hopefully you guys understand that. Perhaps eventually in the future there could be some events happening on Twitch. And as for my website Hepodix.com, it's currently out of service because I feel that's not necessary right now, 
Perhaps in the future if the demand is high, I could reconsider that option as well. Also, quick note on the current world situation regarding COVID-19. I hope everyone is safe and stays healthy. I hope the pandemic will end as soon as possible and until then, please do stay safe. Hope you guys understand my situation and future plans now better and if you're willing to stay that will be super awesome because there are going to be a lot of great gaming related top 10 videos and other stuff coming up, so stay tuned for that. Thanks for listening, my name is Apodix and have a nice day.